Rangers at the Tsangatsanga Reserve set fire to nearly 300 weapons and more than 36,000 traps taken from poachers who are threatening this UNESCO World Heritage Site near the Central African Republic's borders with Cameroon and Congo. Albert Christian Junior Ndade says the poachers are well organized. What makes this more difficult is that we are where three countries share a border. If there is a poacher in Cameroon who takes a protected item from Central African territory, it becomes difficult to pursue him legally. Fewer than 60 rangers work to protect endangered forest elephants across an area of more than 1,200 square kilometers of parkland. The World Wildlife Fund estimates that nearly two-thirds of this species has already disappeared from the country, with only 150 or so forest elephants thought to remain within the park. Ranger Pascal Dombino says the poacher are adept at hunting the animals. The poachers look for the place where the elephants gather to take them down. There is a real danger when the females are with calves. You have to be really careful because she might charge you. Farther along the trail, we see what he means. A female forest elephant, whether he have found out, presents a threatening posture to the patrol as she protects her young. When she sees us here and she has her calf, she now seeks to attack us. We need to avoid that. We can change our route to go around the elephant's position and continue our patrol. Patrols for park rangers here usually last more than one week. But with limited training and few radios, technical advisor Guillaume Dubosc says it's an uphill fight against an illegal ivory network supplied by local pygmy poachers. Because of their knowledge of the forest, the pygmy people are the best hunters. They can shoot forest elephants as close as 30 meters. Ivory sells here for $50 per kilo, but more than 250 after it reaches Cameroon and 2,000 in China. It is not just poachers who threaten forest elephants in the Central African Republic. Anti-government rebels killed 26 elephants in the park during violence in 2014. Researchers here said that unless the killing is stopped, all the forest elephants in this area will disappear within a decade. Tatiana Moso, VOA News, Tsanga Tsanga, Central African Republic.